Hi, I'm Robert. Welcome back to another on the road video brought to you by AcclienceVideo.com. Stop. Before you begin any repair, unplug the appliance from the wall outlet. It is also recommended that you check for proper voltage. The tools you will need to replace the light socket are a quarter inch nut driver and flat blade screwdriver. Today we'll be taking a look at the light socket on the Frigidaire top mount refrigerator. Common issue with this would be that the light does not come on when you open the door. To access this, you must first open the door. To remove the control box assembly, we'll remove one quarter inch screw. And with that screw unscrewed, we'll slide the assembly forward and then drop it down and disconnect the Molex plug in the ceiling and the control box assembly is removed. Now with the control box out, we have clear access to the light socket. We're gonna remove that starting with taking the bulb out of the socket. That way it doesn't break on us. And we'll set that aside. Now we're going to pull the terminals off of the light socket. And if it doesn't pull out easily, you can always use a tool to pry it out or pull it out. Then we'll depress the little plastic clips and push it through and the light socket is removed. Now that we have a new light socket, let's go ahead and install it. You wanna make sure that the open end is facing to the right. Slide it underneath and push the two clips in place. Then reconnect our terminals. In this case with a light bulb, the polarity doesn't matter so much. You're just completing an L1 and neutral circuit. And the light socket is installed. Now we'll replace the bulb and we're ready to reinstall the control box in the ceiling of the refrigerator. Installation of the control box is done by lining up the drain tube coming out of the back of it into the drain hole in the back wall of the refrigerator, and then lining up these slotted holes with these shoulder tabs in the ceiling. So what we're gonna do first is line up the drain hole and then bring the unit up and plug in the Molex plug. And then we're going to bring the entire assembly up, slide it back, onto the shouldered tabs and install the single quarter inch screw in the center of the control box and the control box is installed and that completes the repair. Thank you for watching another quality video brought to you by appliancevideo.com.